That's it. That's the one. You actually found it. Not bad. Mr. Zhu, you must take care of such precious things a bit better. You might not be so fortunate next time. You're absolutely right. How would I have faced my family if I had lost the 253rd ring my mother gave me? Oh, let me explain. My family owns three jade mines, and in order to ensure that I would be able to find myself a good wife, my mother had many jade accessories made as heirlooms. I think there might be over 500 of them. Then why would you feel the need to set up an inn here? Well, inheriting the family business too early unavoidably made things boring. Thank you, all the same. Here's the Mora, as agreed. Please take it. Then... Then I'll take it, gladly. But we did all the work! A disciple should act like one. How can they steal their master's thunder? Exactly! Well, you need to start practicing now. If my rival is as smart as I think they are, they will figure you out in a heartbeat. Uh, what was that rumbling sound? Oh, right. You mustn't have eaten in days. I'm very sorry. I forgot that you have no... Uh, <laughs> that didn't happen. Forget it. <sighs> well... I suddenly feel that you have indeed contributed to our good fortune. I say we spend this money on treating you to a fine meal. If we travel north, we'll reach the Wangshu Inn. I hear the food there is really good, so let's go try it out. No need to thank me. I'm just doing as a good master should. Did she say she was treating us? Is Paimon hearing things? Let's go after her for good food! <laughs> most generous master after all but only if you can finish it all wasting food simply will not do excuse me what would you like to order this is a favorite among our regulars bamboo shoots meat and ham are cooked together creating a richly flavored soup pour a few spoonfuls into each bowl of rice you eat mm, you'll never get enough of it though tofu could not be a more ordinary ingredient it and crab roe are truly a match made in heaven it's one of our specialties It's exactly what it says on the label. Abalone made from vegetarian ingredients. It's just as good as the real thing. These are 
made using large succulent shrimp wrapped in crispy fried potatoes. They have an amazing texture. Uh, all of them? We only have three. No, two and a half people? Isn't that too much food? That's not how you count it. Besides, Paimon hasn't even ordered yet. <clears throat> Squirrelfish, Juyu Chili Chicken, and Juri Soup, please. Sure. And is there anything else you'd like to order, ma'am? I... I'd just like to ask, how much do the current dishes cost in total? Um, around 20,000 mora. Then, uh, I'll... I'll just have some vegetarian noodles, please. something as mundane as Mora. An astrologist's mind is set on studying the stars. Being so easily disturbed by such banal matters would hamper my judgment. Especially the act of overly gratifying oneself using Mora. It is both vulgar... ...and dangerous. So, not eating the dishes we ordered is also part of an astrologist's Right? Paimon doesn't get it. But it feels kind of bad that only we got to feast. Oh, yes, we can do that. Just give us a minute. You don't use more to fulfill your desires, so it's fine as long as you're not buying anything, right? Let's go borrow the kitchen from the innkeeper. Peak season, nothing in the straight on in. Hello. How may I help you? We'd like to borrow the kitchen here. Ah, I see. In that case, sure. As long as you've prepared your own ingredients, feel free to use the kitchen. If I may add one more thing, you must be quite well versed in the art of cooking, yes? <laughs> Talented indeed. From your clothes, you're most likely not from around these parts. But, since you've come to Liyue, would you like to try making Liyue-style cuisine? I have a recipe for golden crab with me. It's a Yue cuisine classic. It's crab meat that's been rolled in flour, deep-fried, and then pan-fried together with ginger and garlic. When you finally plate up, the crab seems to be lying on gold. Golden crab! Golden crab!
spend all that effort on me. I'm not in. I am a little hungry, but it's not a big deal. After peak season, so. this aroma is. Fine. Since my disciple has put in so much time and effort, I must, with great difficulty, accept. Uh, I mean, <clears throat> I never knew that my disciple was this skilled. As your master, I am most comforted. I see that it's no boast to call them Liyue's delicacies. I suppose it wasn't too much to spend all this more on. Ah, it's nothing. Nothing at all. Now that we've eaten and drank our fill, we should be off. If we travel north from here, we should reach the Stone Gate, and from there we will be within the boundaries of Mondstadt. What deep mystery shall we acquire knowledge of? <laughs> I'm looking...